going to bring to you my monthly favorites for the month of November. Uh, I have a lot of beauty, a few beauty things, a little bit of almost everything just about. Uh, so we're going to get started. The first thing that is my favorite, and because we are moved into winter, it's definitely my favorite. <laughs> and it is the Nivea Smooth Sensation um, Body Lotion. This has the Shea Butter and Hydra IQ for deep long lasting moisture and uh, it is for dry skin and it's in the middle between light and rich so it's not as light as some of the other moisturizers but it's not as rich as like the creams like this is like a little disc of the cream that this one I just like throw in my purse for my hands um, but I just love this stuff I mean it just you know very I'm just gonna use a tiny bit here it soaks right into I mean that's all I need and it soaks right into my skin. It just leaves it oh so soft and supple. It doesn't like, you know, some lotions kind of like stay on top and you can kind of still feel almost the greasiness of them. And this doesn't. After just uh, about, a, about two, three minutes on top of the skin, it just sucks it right up. It keeps me moisturized all day long. It used to be called 24 hour moisturizer. I guess maybe somebody probably threw a fit about that claim. It didn't last 24 hours for somebody, so they took that off. So now it's just called the uh, deep and long lasting moisture. And it, it does have shea butter, but it doesn't have like a shea butter smell. Nice fresh smell and I, I use it year round. It's not too heavy for the summertime and it's perfect moisture for the winter time. So it is my go-to. It is my favorite moving on and this has actually been in an empties video and I probably will be doing another empties video here pretty soon because I think I'm accumulating some empties but I am telling you this product it is still on the top of my list and it is and this is empty <laughs> this is the Suave Naturals Creamy Almond and Verbena Body Wash and this is uh, enriched with almond and verbena extract and it contains milk proteins and on the back here um, yeah, it says enriched with moisture, milk proteins, and the fresh scent of verbena, suave, creamy naturals, almond and verbena, will leave your skin feeling soft and smooth and delightfully fragrant. Fragrant. Bleh, bleh. Same great fragrance appeal as Bath and Body Works with creamy milk proteins. Going into skincare. Now, this is a new one for me, but it became a favorite like day one of using it. Once winter time hits, I have pretty normal skin. My T-zone is combo. But everywhere else, I have very normal skin. It's not too dry. It doesn't get oily. In the summertime, my T-zone will be an oil slick. In the wintertime, my nose just flakes away. But this is the Olay Age Define Anti-Wrinkle Day Cream Plus Serum. It's the two-in-one. And uh, this is in the purple packaging. You can find it at Walmart. I believe they just reduced all the prices on these by like a dollar. So I think it's like 10 something like 1048, 1058. I don't know. Somewhere in that range. I actually more than a dollar because I think this used to be like $13. Anyway, you get 1.7 full ounces. And basically how it's described on the box, and I probably I left the box in the other room, but it says how to use this. Gently apply this moisturizer every morning to your face and neck. And you'll look like you on a good day every day <laughs> avoid contact with the eyes you look like a good day every day <laughs> but anyway how it's pretty much formulated is it's like it has two sections in here that you really can't see them and they mix together when you pump it it does have this nice little pump and i find that a one and a half pumps is the perfect amount for my entire face so I basically, I just take it and I rub it in here and then I'm not going to pat it all over because I just have put makeup on, but do, 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 do all over and then blend it in this stuff. Oh my God. Like I'm going to put it on my hands here now. I just put that lotion on, but it soaks in bam, like immediately on contact. I don't know if this is because my face needs that extra moisture and it soaks in like that, but it soaks in so fast. It's got a really good smell to it really fresh um little hint of floral but not 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 heavy so kind of like a fresh floral scent but oh my god it soaks in and i am telling you i love it like especially 
you can't really see it, but under my eyes, I got, it's like bumpy. You know, I have like that bumpy skin texture, you know, especially under my eyes, and I have really large visible pores. So, but this stuff, I mean, it just smooths over all of that, and I tell you, you don't, I don't even hardly reach for my primer after I've put this on, because this almost works as a primer, because this is a serum plus day cream, so it's got the serum properties plus the cream to put on top. I'm telling you, this I love it. So that's pretty much kind of face and body. Uh, little go-to has just been my favorite this month and I just love it. And it's uh, my EOS lip balm in Lemon Drop. <laughs> and oh gosh, it smells so good. It smells like a lemon drop. It really does. And now this one does have an SPF of 15 and I think this is the only one, I think maybe the tangerine that's the medicated might have an SPF in it too. But this one does contain SPF 15, not that it matters to me. It's, mm, I love the smell of it. But this is what I put on before, like while I'm putting my makeup on to moisturize my lips before I put on like my lipstick. And uh, I just, I love these little guys. They're so cute, they're so convenient. God, this one smells so good. It smells like a lemon drop. And you know, these are clear. They don't have, you know, any color at all. They're just clear and just super hydrate. I just love the smell of it. I know I've smelled it like five times. Um, I just really love the smell of it. I have like a whole little candy dish full of these guys, but this one's the one I've been grabbing this month is the, is my little lemon drop guy. Okay, moving on. Hair treatment. One of the things I love to do, and I do this about once a week, is I like to do a really good deep condition. And I'll tell you, I, and I'm also, but, at the same time, I'm silicone free for my hair because the silicones actually don't allow my hair to grab the moisture that it needs so it stays drier. Anyway, so I'm silicone free. So it's not always easy to find a good deep conditioner that is silicone free, but these are fabulous. And these are from Hask, H-A-S-K. This is the Arjan Oil of Morocco, and this is an intense deep conditioning hair treatment comes in these little packages like these, and these are silicone free. They do contain water and argan oil and rice um, extract and collagen and keratin and silk amino acids, uh, soybean oil, panthenol, glycerin again, um, black walnut leaf extract, just all kinds of things, but these are so nice. And this package, I get about two uses out of it um, because I have, my hair is very long, you know, so it's very long. So I get about two uses out of each of these packets. I like to do this once a week. Um, I will, sh I usually only shampoo my hair once a week. I condition it every day, but I don't actually shampoo it, but once a week. So I'll shampoo it and then I'll put this in and then I wrap it all up and then I put on like a little shower or a little, you know, like processing cap, then wrap that up in a towel and I believe this on her for like an hour, sometimes two hours. You could even sleep overnight in this if you wanted to and then rinse it out and oh my God, it just makes my hair say thank you. Okay, so moving on, I'm gonna go into, and I use this thing all the time and I actually just filmed a video using it, and it is the e.l.f. Contour Palette. I am telling you, I have reached for this, I think, almost every day that I have, you know, got myself ready. And it's just, this palette is fabulous. I use the poo out of this, like, yellowish color here for setting my under eye and help brightening that. I've used the highlight a couple of times. It's a nice highlight. I'm not going to say it's not. Um, but it just, I think it's a little too bright for me. I don't know if I'm wearing like a really dark blush and like I put this on and then put the blush on top of it, then I think that helps tame it down a little bit. But these two down here for contour, I usually use this one to contour and I'll use this one to kind of go around you know, like the halo and around my chin, just to help maybe bronze a little bit more so than contour. But in love with this palette. These are $6 a piece. I've never seen one in stores, but I do see them at elf.com. And I'll link my elf haul video down below where I swatch all of these. Next thing from elf. <laughs> I got a couple from elf. 
my blush palette in dark. Oh my gosh. I think this is just so fabulous because it's full of such good colors for fall. And I mean the crazy pigmentation. I mean, yeah, I just graze that crazy, crazy pigmentation on these. This is also in my e.l.f. haul, and I have found these at Walmart and Target, so you don't have to purchase it online. They are available um, in the stores. Um, $6, it's great. This comes in light and dark, but for fall, I've really been sticking with the dark palette. I like the darker colors. All right, next from e.l.f., and this was also in my e.l.f. haul. <laughs> this is the Baked Blush in Pink Tastic. It's not a blush, it's obviously a highlight. It's just a really pretty pink, um, almost champagne kind of highlight. Love, love, love it. It's also in my e.l.f. haul, so you can check that out, but I just, I've been like using this thing every, like I am, I don't know, I'm not in a rut, I'm just, I'm liking what I like. Okay, next from e.l.f., <laughs> This is the matte lip color in wine, and I love these because they're these little, you know, pencils that retract, but they're not a pencil. They're an actual, you know, like lipstick. They're just in this little pencil bullet form, and it, at the bottom, it's so funny in my e.l.f. haul, I had no clue, but if you pull the bottom off, it has the retooler to put your pen back up to its little bullet point, so you, I don't want to pull out too much because then sometimes you can break them. But you put that in there, and yeah, it's like a little sharpener. So you can re-bullet the tip. And I ha I was like, yeah, I know they sell these things and they make them, and I'm sure I'll be able to find one. I'm like, it came with one. Did not know that. <laughs> so, but yeah, this is in the shade. Let me tell you the shade. I didn't even tell you the shade. This is wine. And it's just a really dark uh, burgundy, real pretty. I, re I really like it. It really speaks fall to me. So I've been using this thing to death. Okay, that's it. Oh no, I do have one more from e.l.f. I'll be danged. This is the Instant Lift Eyebrow Pencil in medium or natural brown. I called it medium a thousand times before. This is, I featured this in my products I've changed my mind about and my e.l.f. haul. And I'll tell you what, this little guy here is my game changer. I have used it nonstop to do my eyebrows all month in beginning and last month. I, don't even, I haven't even used my kit. I'm going to have to order another one because that's all I have left. That's it. That's all that's left. I use this thing to death. I just, I'm telling you, I didn't think I'd like it. Totally changed my mind about it, and now I can't live without it. It's got a little spoolie on this side, just your basic spoolie. Does keep, does stay capped though, so that's nice. Keeps it nice and clean. But love it, love it, love it, love it. This is the Maybelline Lash Sensational. For one, it comes in the prettiest pearlized pink tube on the face of this earth. That's a selling point for me because I love pink. But what this stuff does, it's got a little curved brush on one end, on this end, like the moon shape, the bristles are really teeny tiny and short, so they're for separating. And then on this side, they're all fanned out so that you get that butterfly effect. And I'm telling you, what it does for my natural lashes is phenomenal. Fee, nom, eh, no. So, love it, love it, love it, love it, love it, love it, love it. I've used it nonstop. I haven't even given my rocket any love. I, I feel like I'm betraying it. I'll have a moment of silence for that. Okay, now that we've mourned over the rocket, <laughs> let's move on. <laughs> Next up, I just, I actually just recently hauled this and this is in my, I'll link the video below as well. I have a haul where I went to like Walmart, Walgreens and Ulta. And this is the NYX Nude Matte Shadow. And this is in the shade Dance the Tide. And it's just a super warm brown. I've used it in a couple videos. It is my go-to blow out the crease. I have used it for almost every single eye look I have done for my transition blow out the crease color. Um, they have said that this is comparable to MAC Saddle and that's what a lot of people use Saddle for. They really like that for that transition blow out the crease. I've just been 
in love with it. I've, I've used it to death. Another thing that I hauled that's actually in that video as well, and I'll link those of course below, is my Lab Squared or Live and Breathe Beauty Just Blending In Brush. Oh my gosh, I am just in love with this little guy for really getting in there, blowing out the crease, blending everything just flawlessly, effortlessly. It has this rubberized handle. It's nice and long. So, and I, when I'm especially blowing out my crease, I like to kind of hold my brush like this. Like I'm getting all pro on it, you know, like holding it oddly. Like I don't like to hold it like this. I like to hold it way down here, just kind of in my fingers, you know, and just kind of work it. You know, that's how I like to do it. You know, so I think when you get like this, you get a little too heavy handed. But I think if you can hold it down here, you can control it. And I just, I love it. I feel just like so luxurious while I'm doing it. It's a $6 brush. <laughs> Anywho, moving on. <laughs> okay, so these are the last two makeup products. And I am telling you, these are both my go-to. I have just been wearing them nonstop except for today. I changed it up just a little bit today. But it is my Maybelline Fit Me Matte and Poreless um, Foundation and Powder. I am in the shade 230 on both of those, which is Natural Buff. I am just in love with this combination. I did something about this powder. I don't know what, but it really, really sets this beautifully. And it's a, I mean, it's just powder. It does have some coverage, I'll, I'll give it that, you know, and it looks kind of like really light when I swatch it, like, but it really does, you know, it matches my skin tone, and I don't put it on that heavy, so, you know, I put it on with a brush, but there is something about, it does, it is very soft, it's got a nice texture, I'll give it that, and it feels silky like when you rub it between your fingers, but... It just does something for this foundation. I don't know what, but this, oh my God, I am just in love with this. And I do have a whole review slash demo on these. I'll link that below too. Oh my God, this is the video of links. So anyway, <laughs> this, um, I'm telling you, I just, this I love. Like I usually use my color stay a lot because that is full on coverage that I know is not going to move. But I'm telling you, this definitely comes in second. This is medium coverage, but once added with the um, powder, it just, I don't, it takes it to full coverage. It just really does. Love, love, love this combination. So, all right, moving on. Something I hauled, something I love, my, uh, Salon Perfect Demi Wispies. I have just been wearing the poop out of these. I had mentioned in my haul video that I don't wear lashes that often. I'm not wearing any today. But I've been wearing these all the time. So I'm, I'm on the first pack of these I opened. I've probably worn them probably about six times now. They're starting to get a little wonky. So we'll see how many more use. I like lost a few on the edge. I was pulling them off with tweezers and pulled some of them out. It was so sad. But we'll see how long those hold up, but I have nine more pairs of these to go. Last but not least, one of my favorites, and this is my fingernail polish, and I've been wearing it throughout the video. Looks pretty good, right? Yeah, I do my manis on Monday. It is not Monday. It is much later in the week than Monday. <laughs> but this is from the company called Pure Ice. These are $1.97 and they're sold exclusively at Walmart and walmart.com. I do my own nails. Everybody always thinks I have a gel manicure. No, those, I can't wear gels. You work in a hospital, you can't wear gels, tips, overlays, jam berries, none of those. But you can wear, po we, we do a policy where you can wear polish as long as our polish is free of chips because if it looks chipped, that just looks tacky. And you definitely don't want somebody coming in to like do something with, you know, chip tacky looking nails. This stuff gets me through. I love it. The name of this particular shade though is called Scandal. So cute, you know, like off the TV show, but it is just so pretty. It's like a red chocolate. 
kind of like reminds me almost of um, Makeup Geek's uh, Cherry Cola, which they're sold out of. I'm upset about that. Mug is out of Cherry Cola right now. That, everybody I want to order something from is always out of it. But it is. It's just a warm, it's, it's a dark brown with just a little bit of a red undertone to it. So it just gives you kind of a cherry chocolate. Right now for November, this is my favorite because this is like my favorite Thanksgiving color. And I just love this color so much. So that is all I have. It is a lot, I know. <laughs> but these are just things that have been my ride or die. I just can't live without this month. So I really want to thank you for taking the time to watch the video. Um, if you have any questions, uh, please leave them down below in the comments for me. And I will see you all next time. Bye-bye.